Just for the record, my Arab friends, I, uh, I don't do any Arab jokes in my act. It's not that I don't think you're funny, I just, you know, I don't know, I don't want to, I don't know, I don't want to die. Um, see, because I'll do a joke about an Arab, and they'll look like they're laughing. But it's not the same laugh you're doing. Like, I'll do a joke about an Arab, and you guys will be ah, ha, 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 and you look at the Arab guy and be like, ha, 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 ha. Oh no, I get this funny joke. Ha 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 ha. No, no, it's a chlum, it's funny. I get it. Don't, don't worry. I will talk to him after. And whenever they show you like Arabic being spoken on TV, it's always like these crazy people in these protests in the Arab world. And they're all speaking this really harsh Arabic. And so I was like, ha, you should be like, la, 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 la. fuck America! Because that's what they want us to think is going on over there. So I wanted to get to the bottom of this shit, so I went to the Middle East last year. Because I needed to get some rectifying for myself. Is that rectifying? Whatever. I needed to sort this shit out for myself. Because I had this whole impression in my head that Arabic was such an ugly language because it's always like and people are like, oh my god, no wonder they're angry. They're vomiting in each other when they talk. <laughs> then you go to the Middle East and you hear real Arabs speaking Arabic and it sounds nice. I was actually turned on by it. Because I was at this cafe in Dubai and I'm just chilling, right? And there's these two Arab girls having a conversation behind me and I'm eavesdropping. I have no clue what the fuck they're saying. But it sounded nice to me. Because all I hear behind me is, and I was like, oh God, this is good. Oh. But they never show you those Arabs on TV because they're boring. They only show you the crazy. Basically, all they're showing you of the Arab world are the rednecks of the Arab world. That's why their Arabic is so bad. If you were to translate their Arabic accent into an American accent, they'd sound like this. We're going to kill the whole fucking world. That's what they would sound like. That's how the media does it. They show you all the fucked up people. That's all they show is the messed up Arabs. I bet you in the Arab world, all they show them of America is Jerry Springer. <laughs> Look at the Americans, they're fucking stupid. <laughs> He's fucking his cousin. <laughs> Not like you and me, it's different. They're doing it dirty, it's different. We're doing it different, they do some other way. Different. Every time you turn on the news, some new country is starting some war with another Arab country. Everybody's fighting the Arabs and nobody's beating them. You know what that means? Stop fucking with the Arabs. <laughs> Here's why nobody's beating them. Because you can't intimidate them. If you can't intimidate somebody even a little bit, you can't beat them. Like right before the U.S. went to war with Iraq, they warned Iraq. We're going to come there and we're going to attack you. And Iraq went, okay. <laughs> Even the U.S. was like, I don't think you understood. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try it again. We're going to come to your country and attack you. No problem. No problem. <laughs> He's okay. He wants to come. Let him come. Yalla, come. Yalla, come on. Let's go. The U.S. was like, I think we got to break it down for this guy. <laughs> we are going to come to your country and kill you. <laughs> oh, yeah. You kill me. Hey, fuck you. <laughs> I kill me. <laughs> and you. Shamut <laughs> Abiyad. <laughs> 